guys, welcome back to my channel. Long time no talk. Today, the video I have for you guys is going to be a bit of a uh, update and also a tour of what is in my cosmetology school kit. Um, so let's get into it and go ahead and get started because this is going to be a long one. Okay, so since it has been so long since I've talked to you guys, I figure maybe I should probably update you. Um, life's pretty busy. Uh, here's my boy, Brucey. Um, all right, go on, Brucey. Go on. Go on. I decided about a month ago that I was going to go to nail school, and um, I already work in a nail salon, so... They kind of have given me a lot of good peer pressure to go to school and just become a nail tech. So that's what I did. I enrolled um, a few weeks ago and I'm officially in my second week of school. Almost done with it since today is Wednesday. Um, almost done with my second week of school. Um, and it has definitely been a bit of a lifestyle change. Uh, I am not a morning person and classes start at 9 a.m. So I'm going part-time. My hours are 9 a.m. to 2.30 and then two Saturdays a month, um, 9 a.m. to 2.30. And I am still working at the salon every Friday and Saturday evening, uh, but we are only open till 7. So I still have my Friday and Saturday nights open um, to have somewhat of a social life. Uh, our uniform is all black. I did just get home from school. Um, my school is like 40 minutes away from me, so on the days that I do have to work after school, I do get like an hour break um, where I'll come home, change, and kind of decompress before I have to go to work. So that is um, a good thing. It's not like I'm going straight from or straight from straight to work from school. Um, I'm glad I have a little bit of a break in between. Um, but we did get our kits yesterday, and that is the bulk of this video. I wanted to show you guys what I got in my kit. Um, so the kit is included in your tuition cost. Um, for my school, it's $1,700 for a manicuring course, um, and you can either go part-time or full-time. And so it, it winds out to be, if you're full-time, six weeks, and if you're part-time, um, eight weeks. Hello. Thank you for your kisses. My my doggies are pretty needy right now because I just got home. Um, but that's Bruce. Um, and this is Malcolm. Okay, go on. Okay, so I'm going to go grab my kit and then I will be right back. Okay, guys. So this is my kit. It has my name on it. Um, these are supplied to us from OPI. So this pretty much has everything in it that we will need to get us through our schooling. Um, with the exception of a few items that I do have to pick up probably this weekend at like Sally's or Cosmoprof. Um, so it just opens up. It does have a key and a lock on it in case you need to lock it. Um, okay, so this is my manicuring hand. Um, schools in our area kind of downgraded to these plastic gloves you fill with cornstarch and or flour or whatever. And that's that. Um, so we've just been working on like nail wraps and tips and tip tip and blend um this week so that is why that is in there okay the first thing we got in our kit is hand sanitizer from opi the second thing is original um opi's original nail polish remover and then this i just threw in there i had this at home we got um NAS 99, which is like an antiseptic that you spray on your client's hand or fingers um, before you, you know, really get to work on them. We have a jar of Clarité, which is uh, OPI's um, polymer powder for acrylic nails, which uh, Learning acrylics and stuff is necessary for uh, nail school, but at my salon, we actually don't do acrylics because we are all natural, you know, vegan, cruelty-free, non-toxic salon. So it seems kind of pointless to be learning this, but it's good to know it in case I do end up getting a job somewhere at a salon that has acrylics as an option. We got this buffer block. This is a bag of gloves. That did not come in my kit. We got this box of 
some things. Um, it had a little thing of brush cleaner in it. It has um, OPI's Red. It's called OPI Red Nail Polish. And we have a Clarité Curing Resin. This is for acrylics. Uh, we have a thing of Thin Set Nail Adhesive. We have Bond Aid, which is a thinking. This is a... I haven't used this yet, but I think it's a dehydrator for your nails. We have a thing of OPI Pro Spa Nail and Cuticle Cream or Cuticle Oil. Uh, Bond X, which is the acrylic bonding agent for acrylics. And then we also got the OPI Start to Finish Base Coat and Top Coat. That's everything that was in that box. We also got another little box, which I already took it out of there, but this is the OPI Pro Spa Exfoliating Cuticle Cream. We got some sticker nail forms for sculpting nails. These are my little um, nail clips that go on for when you want to remove your gel polish. These I actually got from Amazon. These were not in my kit, but you can get these on Amazon for like eight or nine bucks. Um, this is what we use at my salon. Um, these are like some instruction cards for the Clarité and the Absolute um, Acrylic Liquid and Powder. I have a foot file. I have another thing of uh, polymer powder from the brand Absolute, or it's OPI, but this actually you cannot use at State Board uh, because it's not odorless. So that's why we have Clarité. Um, this is the Crystal Clear Powder. This is another Clarité Simply Natural powder, another Absolute powder, and this is in the shade Perfect White. We have our little Dappen dish, and this is what you put your uh, monomer liquid in when you're working with acrylics. We have a thing of Absolute liquid monomer, and then we have two bottles of Clarité liquid monomer from OPI. And then I've got my brushes. These are the acrylic brushes that came with the kits. Um, these are just some glitters I had at home that I threw in here for nail art and stuff like that um, when I'm at school. Um, we've got a little thing of Clarité Spa White uh, Polymer Powder. And then another thing of Clarité Sheer Pink Polymer Powder. This is our Manny Bowl, so you fill it with water and your hands go like that. Um, then I've got a little packet of lint-free cotton wipes, I guess. And then it came with some paper towels, like absorbent paper towels to lay down. I don't know what that is. Uh, we have a dropper that we use for the liquid monomer um, because you use this to take it from the bottle and put it in your Dappen dish. We've got the little manicure brush that you can use to dust off particles with from your nails. We've got these little toe separator thingies. And in this bag is a ton of utensils. Um, got our file. We've got two nail forms in here. These are reusable ones. Uh, we've got a pair of silk and linen scissors for nail wraps. We have a, another little like buffer file. A little baggie of nail tips. Um, this is a buffer block, well, kind of like a buffer block that she gave to us the first day. I've got a bunch of orange wood sticks. I threw in my dotting tools in here that I had from home. We've got our OPI cuticle nippers, a cuticle pusher, a little pink pair of tweezers, uh, fingernail clippers, and 
toenail clippers. And another nail form, another dotting tool, and the metal um, cuticle pusher that I brought from home. I've had this at home forever. And then this. So that's everything that was in my nail kit. Um, like I said, this isn't like a fancy kit or anything. This is just kind of your basics to get you through nail school. I've seen a lot of YouTube videos where girls have gotten like LED lamps and LED um, like gel sets and stuff like that. We didn't get that. So any of that that we want to buy, we do have to buy um, on our own. But that's everything in my kits. I was so excited to get this. I feel so official. <laughs> Um, and it's just nice to have all my supplies in one place so that I know what I'm doing at school and don't have to sit there without a kit. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll talk to you later. Bye!